Fulton County could be on track to get a new jail, but as you can imagine, it is not going to be cheap. Happening today, the Board of Commissioners is planning to meet and consider a proposal after several inmates died in this facility in just the past year. Atlanta News First, Bridget Spencer is live from the Fulton County Government Center. And Bridget, this new jail is going to be costing taxpayers some serious money. How much money are we talking here? Brooks, you're right. This really won't be cheap. We're talking about a 1.7 billion dollar price tag so certainly not cheap for taxpayers if it is approved the new jail would be built right behind the current facility that we see on rice street now for years the sheriff and county leaders have been complaining about the conditions in the jail saying it's aging and it's also not structurally sound the sheriff says there have been numerous reports of inmates actually taking parts of the building and creating weapons there have also been reports of inmates dealing with unsanitary conditions even dying while in custody so a new billion dollar jail is on the table now. Commissioners will consider that proposal today. Amid this crisis, there are also calls for Sheriff Labatt to step down. He's up for re-election next year. He's a friend of mine, but uh, others have called for him to resign publicly and privately. But in the final analysis, it'll be up to the voters come 2024. Now, today's meeting purpose is to talk about the budget, but they will consider that jail proposal today at 10 o'clock here at the Government Center. We're live in Atlanta. Bridget Spencer, Atlanta News First.